Hey guys, I'm Sunish from Team Must, and in this video, I'll show you how to interface your IR sensor, IR obstacle sensor with uh, Raspberry Pi. So, I'll basically build up a system which would just detect uh, any obstacle and it would signal out by uh, glowing the LED light. So, what I'll need is I'll need three things. Uh, first of all, I need a uh, IR obstacle sensor. Uh, this one is easily available out there on Amazon. Um, I just bought it in a pack of five. So it costed me around 280 rupees. So if you want to buy a single, it would approximately cost you 50 rupees. I'll put the link in the description below if you want to buy it from Amazon. So this is the IR sensor uh, I bought, and apart from this, I need three jump in wires three this is female to female jump in wires which i'll be using to connect uh, the ir sensor with this third component which is required is the raspberry pi 3 this is the uh, raspberry pi third model as you can see it here um, model b so again this this is easily available on any website amazon i bought it from amazon i'll put the link of uh, this also as well so uh, building up uh, you know the entire thing let's start before that i'll just uh, tell you something about the gpio pinout all those pins which you are seeing here you know it really was you know kind of difficult for me as a beginner to to know which pin I, is for what purpose so i'll i just have this pin out diagram out here in front of you so as you can see there are 40 pins here uh, of this raspberry pi listed all of them listed here um, and uh, the first pin is just opposite to the power uh, the place where i'm gonna insert my power so i'll just this, this uh, before that this raspberry pi uh, needs a power supply so i'll just connect it to my charger uh, here so as you can see it's it just boots so the as i was talking about pins the first pin is the one which is exactly opposite to the power supply cable uh, this one and this is one then two uh, so forth third fourth as you can see in the diagram below one two three four this one is one then second and third then out one is fourth so forth so <clears throat> enough with this and let's start how to you know uh, just connect these jumping wires so as you can see in this IR obstacle sensor it, it shows me three pins the first one is listed as output the second one is listed as ground and the third one is VCC output second the middle one is ground the third one is VCC so I'll just plug in three wires let's say I'll put the ground one Uh, let's say the ground one is uh, pink and uh, insert it in the ground pin the output one is green I'll insert this in output pin and the last the third one is VCC which is blue here so this was it now I need to plug the opposite ends of this female to female uh, jump in wires to my Raspberry Pi pinouts. You know these. I need to connect it to these. So as you can see it in the diagram, uh, for power we have second pin available, fourth pin available, and as such. So I'll just insert the power power cable wire. So the power one was. VCC voltage one which was blue I'll just insert the other end um, pin number four you can either you know put it uh, the second pin as well that would work perfectly fine so I'll just put it on four 
now coming up to the second wire the second wire which we will insert is the ground one which i kept pink here and as you can see the ground here is six so i'll just plug this in the sixth pin Oops. Now coming up to the third one uh, which was the green one which was for output as you can see there are multiple outputs available output pins available out here in Raspberry Pi 8th uh, one or 10th one I'll just put that in 8th which is the last green wire great we are now we are done with the wiring and all now let us just test this out uh, does our obstacle sensor really work or not so I'll just bring my hand see the LED light glows the moment I put it away the light is off I could even detect any metal this one would work my sheet this works as well so this was the basic the basic uh, interfacing of IR obstacle sensor uh, connecting it with my raspberry pi so this was it for this video hope you uh, got it how to just assemble this up so i will meet in the next video soon we'll, i'll be covering up another topics um, the python programming the, in the next video I will be explaining you the code how to you know implement this uh, with the very pins of Raspberry Pi. So this was it for this video. Hope you liked it. Uh, make sure to subscribe to our channel Team Mas as a lot 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 more videos coming up. Till then, Team Mas and you go. Bye bye.